All right. Ladies and gentlemen, imagine a world where the norm is simply not enough, where every day is the opportunity to push the boundaries of what's considered normal. In this day of age, my family is way more freaky than all the odds. And then this is the three reasons why. The first reason is how we express our love to one another. The second reason is no matter how far apart we is, we always stay in contact. The third reason is we can sense when when one another is like feeling ill or something. So that's my three ways of how my family is freaking than others. So my explaining more on my first reason. We we express our love by like joking and like clowning one another. When say if you have like a big shirt on, like some big shoes or something, like something that you could joke on somebody with, we do it all day. Every time we make up, we do it. And then you could get mad all you want. We we gonna probably team up and joke on one person the whole day, but we all know it's love at the end of the day. Before we, each other leave, we'll hug, hug it out, tell we love them, and go on about our day. The second reason is how we communicate, how we stay in contact with what I feel like no matter how far apart we is, I'm not missing nothing. Like when I was in Washington, I contacted my people every day. It felt like I was home, so I didn't really get homesick. Besides the food aspect and not having no cooking, then I was like, yeah, I'm not at home. But other than that, I was good. And my third reasoning is, is how we can sense like when one another is like ill or like not feeling right or like having a mental day. It's like once if say if I'm having a mental day, my mom will like wake up early or like feel like something's off and she'll call me or like text me like you okay? I'm like, how can this woman know that I'm not okay? Or like my sister or brother dad text me, you all right? You good? I'm like, how can they sense I'm having a bad day? And I even do it like, one time my sister wasn't having a good day at all. And when I woke up, I was feeling like sluggish. I'm like, and something was on my mind, call your sister today. So I called her. She like, yeah, I'm all right. I'm just not having a good day. So we'll talk it out, make a laugh, joke a little bit, tell her I love her and go home about the day. She say, That'll make her day feel way better. So, boom. So yeah, that's how my family, I feel like my family is freaking, freaking the years by how much we stay in contact with one another. Sensing each other illness or like mental days and joking and expressing our love. Thank you for your attention. May you find the courage to embrace your own freaky culture.